Well, here we are again. I know it's been a long time, but uh, between finding a new place and starting a new job at a new location, then of course the pandemic, and happened to be working in the healthcare field, well, you can imagine it has been some crazy times, but we are back. As you can see, this is the factory bumper. Uh, unfortunately, my D3 bumper got hit by a piece of road debris and is no more. So back to the factory bumper, but can't leave well enough alone. What I did was I went to a website, I believe it's called customcargrills.com. They sell prefab, pre-cut grill inserts. So you basically just cut out the uh, plastic uh, fog grill section that's in here and just glue on whichever epoxy, whatever you want to call it. Obviously don't use Elmer's glue. Uh, to attach it to the plastic As you can see all gooped up. They got plenty of videos of uh, how to from the company um, So I'm not going to go into how to do it, but I'm just showing you where I'm at Basically, I then threw in a couple six inch LED strips tap that to the uh, side marker light and uh, That's it. The only thing I might get around to doing is uh, maybe some more customization of my headlights but otherwise, this car is, I'm not messing with it anymore. After losing the whole front end in that uh, little bit of an accident and all the time and energy and money, um, I'm not doing it. So a little bit of a customization here. The only other thing I'm gonna do is uh, probably do the uh, grip or the uh, emblem. Right now, it's just the, uh, I painted it all black, but I'm, I've already uh, taken, about another one of these online took out the uh, colored inserts. I'm gonna paint the chrome part black and then have the colored inserts as opposed to just all black. Just to give it some more pop in the front end. It looks just like one big black plastic piece in the front. So I thought that might be nice, but uh, that's another project for another time. Here's the shot from the front. So it's supposed to be in that solid black plastic junk that came with the car. I mean, it looked nice, but it didn't really go with the grills that were in the center at all. Completely different design. These were like hexagons and these are squares. So I don't know why they did that as opposed to just matching it up, but it's done now. So next is to uh, put the bumper back on, see how it looks, and then of course, uh, turn on those lights and see how they look. 